Welcome, it's Deronda with Foods 101. Today I'm going to show you how to make these fantastic scrumptious German pancakes with homemade syrup. They're delicious. The ingredients you're going to need for the pancake part is one cup of 2% milk, one cup of all-purpose flour, six large eggs, one half teaspoon of salt, and two tablespoons of butter. For the syrup part, you're going to need one half teaspoon of baking soda, three-fourths cups of granulated sugar, one-third cup of buttermilk. Now don't let this buttermilk scare you because it's going to give it this super tangy, delicious, sweet flavor. Four tablespoons of butter, which is one-fourth cup. One tablespoon of dark corn syrup, but if you want to use light, you may one teaspoon of pure vanilla extract. To finish these German pancakes off, I'm gonna dust them with powdered sugar. I've got about three tablespoons here, and blueberries, about a half a cup, but any berry will do. Strawberries, raspberries, or even bananas. Let me show you how simple this is to get together. I'm using a 13 by nine inch baking dish to make my German pancakes in. At this point, you want your oven preheated to 400 degrees Fahrenheit, and we're gonna add the butter here into our baking dish. Off to that 400 degree preheated oven to let your butter melt. Now that your butter's melted, you're gonna swish it around from side to side to make sure that you coat your baking dish. Be sure to keep your eye on your butter while it's melting in the oven because you don't want your butter to burn. Now we can sit this off to the side. In a blender, we're gonna add all of our eggs. I use a measuring cup to crack my eggs in because it makes it a whole lot easier to put in here. Add your milk. Make sure you put your wet ingredients in first. Your salt, that way the flour won't stick in the bottom of your blender. Add your top. Turn your blender on. Mix until just processed. It won't take long. That looks fantastic. Back with our prepared baking dish. I'm gonna swish that butter around till we get an even layer here on the bottom. Start adding our pancake batter right here into our dish. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be delicious. Off to that preheated oven. Be careful. On the middle rack for the next 20 to 25 minutes or until golden on the top, use your timer and no peaking. Meanwhile, in a small saucepan over medium heat, we're gonna add the butter. Add your buttermilk. Don't be afraid of buttermilk. It's gonna give it a fantastic flavor. Add the corn syrup. You can use dark or light, remember. Add that baking soda. Add your sugar. Give it a stir and wait for this to come to a boil. I had to transport my syrup from this small saucepan into a medium saucepan because it was getting ready to tumble over the edges. Give this a lovely little stirring and we're gonna let this boil for seven minutes. Use your timer and continue stirring. Seven minutes are up. Look at that beautiful color. Absolutely fantastic. Move this off the heat. Over here to the back burner. Immediately add your vanilla. Whisk it in. Mmm, and it smells so yummy. We've got about four more minutes left on our German pancakes here in the oven. And ooh, they're starting to smell yummy too. And we're gonna let this sit here and we're gonna let it cool down until we're ready to use. Here's that German pancake and look how it puffed up along the edges. And my whole house smells so yummy. It's going to fall back into its pan as it sits here and cools for a little bit. But the idea is to serve it when it's super piping hot. You never know what kind of shape you're gonna get. I'm gonna drizzle that homemade syrup here over the top, or you can let people spoon out however much of the German pancake they want and add their own syrup, or they may not want the syrup at all. If you could be here and smell, I'm so excited. Tell you the truth, I've never made one of these. I know it's going to be fan. Fantastic. Oh yeah, got a little bit more syrup left over. And if you wanna double your syrup, you be my guest. In a sieve, I'm adding that powdered sugar and I'm just gonna sprinkle over the top of our German pancakes. Get the edges. Add your blueberries. Oh yeah, oh yeah, my mouth, it's watering. Mm-hmm, beautiful. Let's see what this tastes like. And I can tell you it's gonna be scrumptious. I've got the end piece. 
gonna add it right here on a plate add a little bit more syrup not necessary I'm gonna leave that up to you just for looks a little powdered sugar gonna leave that up to you and a couple of more blueberries dig in I know it's gonna be absolutely scrumptious gotta get a little blueberry there mm-hmm here it goes Wow fantastic mmm lovely warm it has a custard like texture um, very light airy that little bit of syrup the powdered sugar and these blueberries really make it a fantastic dish a great crowd pleaser look it makes a lot fantastic for morning guests that you have at your home for your family on the weekends or even on the weekdays and looky there that puffiness on the end of your German pancakes it's absolutely scrumptious you all give me thumbs up leave me a comment hit that notification bell to be the first to get my new YouTube food videos thanks a million for watching and I'll catch you lovely people later